Right now at 10, the son accused of severely beating his mother is in jail awaiting charges. A relief for the family left unnerved by this violent attack. Our Kaylee Bourgeois spoke with the grandson of the victim and joins us live tonight with their thoughts on his arrest. Kaylee. Lisa, this is a story that's really captured a lot of attention, both from the community and the more police here. And the family says it's been positive attention that's helping them move forward. It's been an awful week for Jeffrey Nelson. I've had to put on the strong face, but for her, we're just worried about my grandmother. Jeffrey's grandmother called him Wednesday. She said that she was beaten up, so of course my head is spinning. I don't know what to expect. What he found was worse than what he could have expected. His grandmother beaten beyond recognition, and the suspect was her own son, David Nelson. Jeffrey says his uncle David took off before police could arrive, and the family spent the next two days spreading the word on Facebook. And then it just kept getting momentum and more momentum. I was actually really glad because I'm like, someone is bound to run into him. And someone did. David was arrested yesterday, booked in the Cleveland County Jail on an aggravated assault charge. His nephew says it isn't his first time behind bars. Just beating women. He's been an alcoholic his whole life. But Jeffrey's hoping this is the last time David hurts someone close to him. And this time, his grandma has the support of the entire community. She's been sent flowers and cards from people who saw the Facebook post. And Jeffrey says the more police have also stepped in to help her heal. They have been here like every day, checking up on her, making sure that she's okay and making sure that she's safe. The family says they do feel safer with David behind bars, but some bruises will take more time to heal. Even though he hurt her physically, the emotion part is going to take a minute. And the family tells us they believe this is the first time that David allegedly assaulted his mother, and they say that he had been living with her for the past few months. On the scene on the story and more, Kaylee Bourgeois, News 9.